And today our hands will be in the open mudra because we are in the world of gratitude today. So let's just keep them like that. Take a deep breath. And today is Sunday, so just do a meditation. Kuldeep ji, aap bhi meditation kar do saath. So, all right. Let's close our eyes. Take a deep breath in. Fill your lungs with infinite love. Fill it completely. Soak your body. Love, love and love. Exhale love and share as much as possible with so many people, with things, with circumstances, with events today on this beautiful soulful Sunday. Take a deep breath in and fill your body with unconditional love, no conditions attached. Loving ourselves, loving our organs, loving our blood circulation system, loving everything internally. And as we share and exhale our love, we share our love for the world, for the life that we live in. Everything is bright, beautiful. And the third time for this morning, let's inhale loving acceptance. I accept everything in its totality as it is right now. Knowing that as I exhale, this too shall change because I have now accepted it. Let me be the mirror of my life. Let life show me what I am truly echoing from deep within. Let's tell our beautiful life Dear life, you are magical. Dear life, you are a real blessing. Dear life, you are so full of goodness. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being you. I have gone through so many ups and downs. And now I realize that every day also there are ups and downs. And whenever I go down, that is when I am heightening, elevating my love for gratitude and finding what blessing can I count. I'm a person who's going inwards, realizing the wealth of information, the treasure boxes within me. And I am full of them. Day by day, minute by minute, I'm learning to be grateful. I'm embracing an attitude of gratitude every single day because I realize the power it has is infinite. The more I sense it, the more I feel it, the more I count it, the more it grows, expands. I now realize the power is within me. Whatever I'm finding finding outside is very much here within me. The light has come. I give and receive gifts graciously every single moment. Gift of life, gift of love, gift of growth. Deep at the center of my being, there's an infinite well of gratitude. I allow this gratitude to fill my heart, my body, my mind, my consciousness, my very being, my essence. This gratitude radiates out from me in all directions, touching everything in my world. And it turns to me multiplied because I am so much grateful, so, so grateful. The more gratitude I feel, the more aware I get that supply is endless. The universe is a giver full of beautiful stuff. Appreciation and acceptance act like powerful magnets for miracles every moment of the day. The more I appreciate, the more I am in acceptance mode. Compliments are gifts of prosperity. 
I compliment people and I become more prosperous every moment. I'm learning to accept them graciously. Whatever compliments come my way, I take them with a heart full of love and gratitude. If somebody compliments me, I no longer shirk away and make excuses of being embarrassed because now I'm open and receptive and I say thank you. Today, the Soulful Sunday is a sacred day for me, a sacred gift for me. If you wish, you can open your hands or otherwise just listen to it. I open my arms wide to receive the full measure of prosperity that the universe offers. Any time of the day or night, I can let this beautiful prosperity in. I am prospering every moment. The universe supports me in every way possible. If you wish, you can put your hands back in a comfortable resting position or keep them open however you're comfortable. I live in a loving, abundant, harmonious universe and I am so grateful. There are times in my life, however, when the universe gives to me, but I'm not in a position to accept or give back. And that's okay. I can think of many people who help me enormously at many a times. When there are so many places that I can't even repay them, but that's okay. However, I continue to be in the cycle of life where I help somebody else without expecting a favor because I know the more I give, the more I get. So I am a little selfish, but I also know that my selfish act is causing abundance in the universe because I am a channel of blessing for someone and consciously I'm trying that every day. That's the way the life goes. I relax and rejoice in this abundance and this gratitude that I am feeling in deep within my heart this very moment. I now imagine myself in standing in front of a mirror. And right now, in front of the mirror, I'm just feeling as if I'm touching myself, my hand touching the mirror. So the hands in the mirror are touching me. Our body parts, maybe our joint of our knees are touching each other. We are facing our own self in the mirror. If you wish, you can hold hands with the inner self, with your person in the mirror. That is your extension. Hold hands with him or her. Look into her eyes. Look into his eyes. And take a deep breath in. And feel any, any fear that you feel. Just release it as you exhale. Any fear. Take another deep breath in and release your judgment. And allow yourself just to be with that person. You no longer judge him or her for the hair, the eyes, the face, the body structure, the complexion, how it looks physically or how it is internally. You just embrace the person in the mirror, your extension beautifully. Your hands are touching each other. You're connected. Now try and look in the mirror in the reflection of your eyes. What do you see? We are all one. We breathe the same air. You and I am the same. The same water, the same food. Everything is available to us. The same sessions, the same classes, the same books. We all have similar desires. We all have similar needs. That's why we are here in the power of dreams. We all want to live comfortably, peacefully, magically, magnificently, richly, abundantly. We all want to prosper. We all want to live our lives full of fulfillment. Where we feel accomplished. We all want to look at each other with love. You, my dear one in the mirror, I love you. I know you're always ready to love me back. And I have been skeptical many a times, but I love you. You are healthy. I am healthy. The world is healthy. Let everyone, including you and me, have the most magical relationships right now between you and me. 
then with maybe our partners, our, ch our children, our parents, our family, our colleagues. Let's affirm prosperity in every relationship. Let's affirm comfort and safety for ourselves and everyone around us. Let's know that whatever we give comes back to us multiplied so much. We deserve it. We accept it openly because we are the channels to receive and accept so easily. All of us are in harmony with ourselves. All of us are centered in truth and peace. No matter where we go, we all identify knowing that there's one spirit, one God, infinite goodness, infinite wisdom, infinite harmony, and infinite unconditional love. There is no duality. Therefore, right here, right now, in our place, in where we are, we declare and we affirm that there's only infinite harmony, wisdom and love and that is within me. There are no problems, but they only have solutions. There are no questions without answers. Let each one of us become a learner, a student for life, always learning, always growing. Let, let's all know that we have infinite wisdom guiding us with the best possible solutions for whatever problems that come our way. Problems means more results, more choices. So let's bring it on. If there's anything, I'm ready to face it. I choose to go beyond the problem to seek the divine right, the right action, the right solution to any discord that may appear in my true harmonious atmosphere. I know they come for a reason and I am ready for seeing the reason. We are willing to learn and to grow from this discord, this confusion. In fact, we release all the blame right now. No more blame game. Let's play the game of gladness, glad game. Let's grow. Let's seek within the truth which is within us. Each one of us is willing to release whatever patterns we have in our subconscious mind, which may have contributed to some patterns going again and again and again. We release them all, all once and for all. We choose to know the truth. The truth sets us free. Divine wisdom, divine love, divine harmony reigns supreme. Our business is beautiful. It's God's business. And we are now directing, leading all our movements into equanimity. We declare that we as a person are all about peace, security, harmony. And we have a deep sense of love for ourselves life and joyous livingness. We are willing to love ourselves, we're willing to love others, we're centered in truth and we live in abundant joy. Our life becomes more magical because we are magic intertwined in ourselves. We're living, breathing, drinking, eating magic. And let us become the channels of love and light. Let us become the channels of blessings. Dear universe, always make that conditioning in our mind. That each one of us is the giver, unconditional giver. Each one of us is light. Each one of us is love. Each one of us is a channel of blessings. And so it is. So be it. So it is. Let's bow our heads in gratitude for our Mother Earth for being an unconditional giver. Dear Mother Earth, may I be just like you. Thank you for everything. Let's expand our heart level and say to our life, dear life, you have been absolutely awe-inspiring. Today I see that whatever I went through was there for a reason. But today I'm also going to go and see within to see the patterns that are coming up, the questions that are coming up. What is it that I need for my life? So dear life, thank you. Dear now, thank you for everything. Dear future, you are magical. Now you can expand your hands and look at the universe above and just say it with your closed eyes. I love you, universe. I love you. Thank you for having my back. 
thank you for making me so amazing that I can handle everything in the world. Thank you, teachers, gurus, guides, angels, guardians, for always having my back. Now, you can fold your hands and you can tell yourself, today on this beautiful Sunday, I have a sankalp of going within me. I have a time to go within me for some time, 20 minutes at least, to ask myself a question. What is it that I feel when I earn whatever I want? What is it that I finally know about me once I've achieved and gained that financial goal? And to who is it that I'm proving whatever I'm proving out to be? Let me find my hidden agendas. Let me go inwards. Let me find the truth of life. And may this be the best journey of my life being today, commencing in this new year, this new week, on this beautiful Sunday, a day to relax, a day to be soulful. And now let's rub our hands together. Bless our face, our front side of the body, up to down, our back side of the body, down to up. And to the energy that flows within us, as I fold my hands, please, please, please continue to flow as much as possible and make my body free of all toxicity, be in thoughts, be in diseases. May I be easy and I am easy. I am flowing with love. I'm flowing with light. I am the channel of blessings. And with this channel of blessings, may my hands open up and share its love and light and blessing and healing wishes to all my beautiful Sangha Mitras, with all sentient beings, with all beings on Mother Earth. Let there be love, let there be light. Akshay Shivani.